Welcome to this Let's Talk Machines, This is How I Glyph, a series where we review scripts that have been written to automate very specific tasks and point-wise or the entire machine process. In this video, we're taking a look at split kinds at intersection.glyph, both GUI-driven and non-interactive versions of this script. This script allows users to split two connectors wherever they happen to intersect. Users may be familiar with the ability of PointWise to create a point of intersection where two database curves intersect using the intersect command found in the Create menu. In the intersect panel, select the first set of curves to be added to Group A, click on the Group B radio button, select the second set of curves, and then click Intersect. Points are added wherever the two sets of curves intersect. Note that the original curves are not split, but you can easily determine their points of intersection. However, the same isn't true for connectors. If you have two intersecting connectors and wish to split them at their intersection, determining that point isn't as straightforward. At best, the graphical user interface allows you to eyeball the approximate location to where you wish to split the connectors. Therefore, the split cons at intersection.glyph script was written to provide users with this capability. As with other scripts in PointWise, you can run the script via the execute command in the script menu. An open save dialog window opens where you can navigate your local file system to where the script resides. Select the script and a TK graphics window appears with GUI elements users can use to perform the split operation. First click on the button labeled select first connector and use the display window or list panel to select the first connector. Use the Select Second Connector button to do the same for the other connector. If you happen to select the wrong connector, then you can clear the selection and begin again by clicking the Clear Selection button. Click Apply to perform the split operation and continue with additional connectors, or click OK to split the connectors and exit the script. Now, if you're like me and prefer to avoid having additional interactive elements interfere when performing such a utility operation, there is a second version of this script in which you can select the two connectors prior to executing the script, execute the script, and have the connectors in your active selection split. If there is no active selection, then PointWise will prompt users to select two intersecting connectors without the additional clicks required by the GUI elements accompanying the first script. This can save a little bit of time in conjunction with the re-execute command, which runs the last script that was executed if there are multiple connectors that you need to split. You can initiate the re-execute command using the Ctrl plus E keyboard shortcut on Windows and Linux platforms and Command plus E keys on Mac platforms. The scripts leverage the ability of PointWise to find points of intersection between two database curves as described earlier. The selected connectors are used to create database curves that match the shape of the connectors, and then the intersect command is run on these database curves to create points where the curves intersect. These points are then in turn used to split the original connectors, and finally all of the database entities created during the operation are removed. If you liked this video, then be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or comments, then drop us a line down below or connect with us on Twitter using the link in this video's description.